Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. You know, well, let me ask you this. I seen you on a picture with Dre. Um, how did how how did how was you in his relationship? We Dr. Got, Dr. Dre. Yeah. I mean, just, I just seen you on the picture. How did that end up happening? Uh, we don't have a relationship. You know, it ain't like me and him cool. Or I yeah, mean, I mean, we 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 cool as, but I had to give bro props. Okay, you dig what I'm saying? Uh, when he made the deal uh, with Apple, and he became the first black billionaire of the city of Compton, right? So um, before this, uh, I had asked, the, the new mayor had came in, uh, Kendrick was on, Problem was on, uh, DJ Quick, we got some amazing dudes out of our 10 square miles. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we had more blacks going to the Olympics at a time than any state. You know what I'm saying? It's great things happen out of Compton, California. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I approached the mayor, who was Asia Brown at the time, and uh, uh, asked him, like, man, we need to, um, you know, give something for the rappers. Uh, you know, uh, uh, NWA made gangster rap. Mm -hmm. You know, they, they, they Compton do some shit. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, we don't want we don't want Compton to go in that direction. We trying to change. We don't want to get rid of the gangster. So when Dre got the got the money, they start asking Dre. Dre wasn't accepting no calls. So. I went in myself with my own money, and I made June 19th, you know, most kids don't know what Juneteenth is, mm -hmm. so I made Juneteenth in the city of Compton, Dre Day. Wow. So I put on a festival, I gave them a, a hood pass, and it's, I got a, got a plaque with all the freeways on the side, and all the original OGs from Compton, California, give them a pass. I had some scrolls made, and everybody from all the schools signed them, and gave them That's to dope. them. Had some shirts made. You wow. understand me? Uh, Dre Day. You wow. Know, Dr. Dre. So you give homage to, you ain't got to kiss and hug and this and right. that. But it's you some things homage. you just got to do. That's I mean, it. why you do that? He a crip. He did this. He's an artist. He's a black artist. You exactly. know what I'm saying? And he's doing things. You know, that's why I have, why I'm here. Because it's a lot of people say stuff about California that have no relevance. Okay. You, you just looking over here. You don't know what we didn't really did. Okay, let me ask you this. Um, like when you uh, you you spoke earlier and you had a uh, you you mentioned Suge Knight being in California as long as you've been. Did you ever have any actions with uh, Suge Knight? I was I was there when Suge uh, ran over Terry. Okay. Uh, um, you, I was v I've been in, very involved with Suge. Okay. You know, uh, even before when I got out of prison in '95. Um, we did the original security for uh, for Tupac. Okay. And uh, when he did Gridlock, mm -hmm. I and, remember that. And we we worked with him in the Nation of Islam. Worked with Pac until Suge made the uh, disastrous decision to hire the police. Yeah. Okay. And, and why Why do you say the disastrous decision? Because everything went bad after that. What went good? I mean, when he was with the Nation, what not shit happen? Pac didn't deal with no police. Okay, and he don't like he didn't like police. So if you listen to interviews, the only two people that really dealt with Pac one on one was Frank Alexander and Michael Moore. Michael Moore is a fireman out of Long Beach. Frank was an ex seal or this and this and this and that. So after the disaster that happened in Las Vegas, the only two that opposed anything that the common story was, the truth wasn't told. But the only people that were telling the truth, both of them end up dead. Mm. How'd that happen? Wow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you got all the rest of these suckers that's telling the story, they lie, they kicking it. You know, but that ain't the truth. Mm. You know, that is just my little bitty opinion. <laughs> but I was there. Hey. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.